Rutherford B. Hayes was the 19th President of the United States, serving from 1877 to 1881. Born in Delaware, Ohio, on October 4, 1822, Hayes was the son of a storekeeper and a schoolteacher. He was educated at Kenyon College and Harvard Law School, where he graduated in 1845. After practicing law in Ohio for several years, he entered politics, serving as a member of the Ohio State Senate and as a U.S. congressman. Hayes served as a Union Army officer in the American Civil War, rising to the rank of Major General. He was wounded several times, including at the Battle of South Mountain, where he was shot through the arm and chest. After the war, he was elected governor of Ohio and served three terms, from 1868 to 1876. He was known for his strong support of education and civil rights, and for his efforts to reform the state's prison system. In 1876, Hayes was nominated for the presidency by the Republican Party. He ran against Democratic candidate Samuel J. Tilden, and the election was one of the most controversial in American history. Both candidates claimed to have won the election, and there were disputes over the results in several states. After a long and contentious battle, a special electoral commission was established to resolve the disputes. The commission voted along party lines to award the presidency to Hayes, and he was inaugurated on March 5, 1877. As president, Hayes was committed to preserving the Union and restoring the country after the Civil War. He worked to improve the economy, reduce government spending, and promote civil rights. He signed the Compromise of 1877, which ended the Reconstruction era and granted amnesty to former Confederate soldiers. This compromise also withdrew federal troops from the South, leaving African Americans vulnerable to the violence and discrimination of the Ku Klux Klan and other white supremacist groups. Hayes also worked to promote education and economic growth. He signed the Bland-Allison Act, which required the Treasury to purchase a certain amount of silver each month, and the Resumption Act, which required the government to resume the payment of greenbacks in gold. He also signed the Sherman Antitrust Act, which prohibited monopolies and trusts. He was also a strong advocate for the rights of women and was the first president to appoint a woman to a federal position. Hayes was known for his integrity and honesty and was respected by both political parties. He did not seek re-election in 1880 and instead retired to his home in Ohio. He died on January 17, 1893, at the age of 70. Throughout his life, Rutherford B. Hayes was a dedicated public servant and a champion of civil rights and education. He worked tirelessly to restore the country after the Civil War and to promote economic growth and social justice. He is remembered as one of the most honest and respected presidents in American history, and his legacy continues to inspire generations of Americans.